Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so happy to be back with you guys. Uh, first of all, I wanted to say, well, Mother's Day was yesterday, but I want to say Happy Mother's Day to all the beautiful moms out there. And I hope that each and every one of you were spoiled and had a great day full of love and peace and joy with all your loved ones. And uh, for all the gentlemen out there who filled the role as mom, I'm wishing you guys out there a happy Mother's Day as well. So today I have kind of a random kind of video. Um, I have a really small, small, small Dollar Tree haul. I went in there just to grab a couple of like necessities that I needed and I couldn't really go too crazy although I really wanted to because they had a lot of really cool stuff um, but I did pick up a couple of things like I said it's really like a small haul but I wanted to just share with you some other random uh, items that uh, you know I've been given over the weekend so so first of all because it was Mother's Day um, my granddaughters were here and when uh, my oldest granddaughter Michaela when she came in she gave me this beautiful picture it's it's a whole bunch of flowers it's just beautiful and on the back and this is what I love um, it says, um, I made you a flower with my finger and my thumb, so you will have these memories for all the years to come. Joyeuse Fête des Mères 2019, Michaela. So that was my first gift from the girls. Um, the next thing that they gave me, and I just love it so much, uh, it's this beautiful it looks like a tea light holder. It's really pretty on the inside. And it says, you never know how much love your heart can handle till you are called grandma. So I'm so happy. Like, um, I'm going to set this right in my room here so that I can look at it all the time. It's just so beautiful. Uh, what else do we got? Uh, just a couple of random yard sale items that Mark got. Actually, he got me some, um, sweaters, uh, like long sweaters that you can wear with like, uh, you know, like stretch pants or workout pants or whatever. Um, and one was like, uh, with greens and different colors in them with a little tie to tie around your waist. And the other one was a black one. And he did find, um, uh, these two wallets for me. And, um, I don't know what he paid for anything, but, um, you know, he, he did, he always remembers me. He always gets wallets. He always gets anything cute, you know, so he's, he's, I just love him so much. He's so good to me. So, um, anyways, so he gave me these two wallets. Um, this one here, I do, I've never really used like these kind of wallets with the clip like this. I don't think I have. Uh, this clip closes up real nice and it's kind of like a bluish, navy bluish kind of uh, material, like a pattern kind of material. And um, the inside is really basic. It's, it's actually really cheap on the inside. You can't really get in, like you can hear it too. But what I am going to do with this, guys, is I am going to make a notebook out of this. Um, so I'm going to pull out all of the insides, the guts on the inside, and I'm going to create a notebook with this, and this will be the clip to close the notebook. So stay tuned for that. If you want to see a DIY with that, um, I'll do one with you. And, yeah, it's a great way to use up, like, you know, if you see a wallet that you like on the outside, but the inside is, you know, kind of old or, you know, there's stains or there's rips or whatever, or it's just cheaply made because a lot of wallets on the inside, they're just really cheaply made. This one is super cheaply made. So yeah, so I'm still going to use it. I still, I really love it. And yeah, I'm going to make a notebook out of it. So uh, stay tuned for that. Uh, the pink one here he got, I do love. 
I do really like it. Uh, it's the same kind of clip. It doesn't have a brand where these are from. I have no idea where they're from. It has the nice little uh, wristlet strap. And the inside of this is actually quite nice. Um, it looks the same, but the material is more substantial. You know, you can actually get in here and put your cards in here. So I am going to be using this. I really like it. Um, so yeah, and of course it's pink, so it's the color that I love. So I think I'm going to eventually switch over to this one because I want to see how much it can hold and it's very thin so it's not like you're carrying like a huge huge wallet so super happy to find that um let's see the last thing actually he got me from the yard sale and I know it seems like really weird to share it but I want to share it with you guys um he got Sorry, my bag's falling over. Um, he got this box of staples with this really nice stapler. This stapler is substantial. It's made by Rubbermaid, um, and it's gold. And that's why I wanted to show you guys. It's so nice, and it's it, it's just it's really pretty. So I really really liked it. Um, the top of it is worn off a bit, like the gold and stuff. So. I may do a DIY to the top of this as well, just to kind of get it. I really want it to look really girly and really, really cool, but it is super nice, a really nice stapler, and it's really substantial. So so he got me that too, because he knows I'm always doing stuff with my planners and all that good stuff. So I think the rest of the stuff in here is Value Village. I, actually, sorry guys, I forgot to share one last thing from my little granddaughter. This one is from Madison, and she drew all the little hearts for me. And on the inside, it says, Happy Mother's Day, Grammy. Love, Madison. So, super happy to have that. All right, guys. What you been waiting for? Small Dollar Tree haul. Um, I've seen this bag there. I, I've seen you guys haul these bags. I love them. They're super cute. I'm pretty sure that you can color these. It's like a color, like you can color these. Um, and I love what it says, follow your dreams. I love how it's in like a rainbowy kind of color. Like I said, it's, it's nice. And the straps are this nice minty green color. And what I really like as well, because you know Dollar Tree, they always have their bags are awesome. So the side of the bag, and this is what it's looked, it looks like. It's so pretty. It has all the stars on it and everything. So I'm going to use this as my bag that I keep in the car. If I go in anywhere, I can use that to bring my stuff out. It's so cute. So, so let's start with the Dollar Tree. Like I said, I don't have many things. Um, the things I did find, I was happy to kind of find, so there's like very little items here. So I'll start with one of the boring ones. I don't know if you guys have tried these. They're the peppermint uh, wrapped candies, and I got them to put in my purse and to just set out here at the house. But Mark, I think it was Mark said that they weren't very good. Um, I haven't tried them yet, but if you guys have, let me know. Because they come in cinnamon, they come in winter, winter mint, I, I believe as well. Um, there's a few different brands. So, I mean, if it, they are good, you can't go wrong. There's, um, let's see. Yeah, it doesn't really tell you how many are in here. It's 150 grams, 5.29 ounces. Uh, but you get like tons, like tons of candies in here. So... I'm going to give those a try. If you guys have already tried them, let me know. Oh, I just wanted to show you guys uh, the pen that I got from Walmart. And um, I've been really into the friction pens. And I actually used a different friction pen the first time that got me on friction pens. And I'm wishing that I would have still gotten that. But... Um, when I went to Walmart, they didn't have them. They just had these. And it's pretty good. It writes really nice. I really love using it for my planner. It's erasable. But they're not cheap. Like, for two pens, it was like six something. But I love how they write. And I, I really like using 
using it in my planner. So, so I did pick that up at Walmart. Um, I'm really into learning more about stationery, like different pens and that kind of stuff. So if there's a certain kind of pen or like fine tip markers or anything like that, let me know if you guys know of any, especially at the Dollar Tree, if there are any good there. Um, I have picked up pens there before, but sometimes they're not always the great ones. Sometimes you luck out and get some good ones. Um, the next thing I have this uh, bag, these came three in a set for a buck twenty-five. You can't go wrong, and I got it because of Mother's Day. Um, I put a couple of packages together and put them in these little bags. They're really cute, really nice uh, foiled roses on them, and they're not very big. They're small, but you know you can fit quite a bit in them. And uh, the side is just the same as the bag, and the handle is just like that. So yeah, so that was three in the pack. I've already used used that up. The next thing I got at the Dollar Tree that I seen that, um, you know, a lot of you guys had hauled, but um, I didn't see after a while, and then they had like three of them sitting there. I finally picked up these binders. Of course, I got the pink. Um, these are the binders from Jot, the little mini binders. And I really want to do something with these in terms of planners, budget, uh, a budget planner, something that I want to use these for. So I picked up two of them. So there's those two there. I also, I was, I was so uh, surprised and excited to find that they had LA Colors, the Color Craze Nail Polish. Um, they usually carry it, but it's always the same kind of colors, and they're not really nice. But I was really happy to find these two. I got the same color, um, and it's in this really nice pink. And uh, it says jelly on it. I don't know if that's the name of the color, but... Yeah, I'm not sure. Um, anyways, I really like this. It's a really nice pink. So, got that. Okay, guys. Seriously, these are awesome. As soon as I walked in, I seen them. They are the jumbo paper clips. Uh, I got two packages of these. One I am already using in my planner, which you'll see. Um, here shortly when I do a video about my planner and it's black pink and gray which are the colors I love really nice substantial paper clips you, you know seriously you cannot go wrong a buck 25 for that if you went to Michael's to buy something like this it would be a lot more money so you know for a buck 25 for the paper clips I am not complaining gum the next thing I got, um, which I wasn't going to get as many, I was just going to get the pink ones of these. I've noticed you guys hauling, and somebody had mentioned about doing something with their planner with these, as opposed to what they're used for. They're actually like luggage tags, uh, well, backpack tag, and it has the name, address, city, country. I... I'm really wanting to do something with these with for my planner, but I'm not sure what I'm going to use them for. So I just wanted, sorry guys, I just wanted the two pink, but as I was going through the bin, I noticed these ones there, and I really love that. It has like the pink and the teal and the, like it's just so beautiful. So I picked up two of those. Um, if you guys have any ideas for these, any DIYs, um, let me know because uh, I may keep one just for, you know, just for purposes of traveling or whatever. But um, otherwise, I really want to do something with these in terms of my planner or something for my bag. I'm not sure. So you guys let me know. They're super pretty, you know, and I didn't want to leave them there for that because if I don't use them right now, I know eventually I'm going to be wanting to use them for something. So... So the last things, guys, 
that I got and um, they're, these are the chipboard die cuts and I was really surprised to find these and they are substantial. They are very nice. Uh, you get 20 pieces in here and it's from the Forever in Time brand and in this one you get the camera which I absolutely love. The little drink here uh, looks like a little surfboard or something and then this little guy here so they are so nice um let me open them up so i want to see yeah so that's what they look like very substantial like they're very thick like i'm trying to bend it right now and i can't bend it so that's what the front looks like and again you can color all these in the way you like if that's what you want to do or you can just go for a plain look so there's that guy there's the little drink oh I love it I love the camera love 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 it I have this thing with cameras I, just crazy um, I really will be making paper clips actually with this one here so so yeah, um, they're very substantial, really nice. I'm just going to set these down because I'm going to drop them. And I also got the um, the ones with the star, the cloud, the little mermaid, and the unicorn. Super cute, guys. You can't go wrong. A buck twenty-five for that, you get 20 pieces. And like I said, they're hard as a rock. Like, I can't, you know, that's that's trying to bend it, and I'm using force, and you can't. So, if you see these at your Dollar Tree, pick them up. The last one I got was with the different fruits, with the donuts, the pizza, the ice cream, and that there. So, yeah, super happy to find that. Yeah, so anyways, I didn't get very much... Um, like I said, I just went in there for some necessities, but I was super happy to find the treasures that I did find. And like I said, um, I was spoiled at Mother's Day just to be with my kids and, um, you know, their presents and, the, and I don't mean presents as in gifts. I mean them being there with me, here with me. That's all that, you know, a mom could ask for. So... Anyways, I love each and every one of you. Please like, comment, subscribe, and um, stay tuned because I have a few other videos coming up here shortly. So take care, guys. Love you so much. Woo! Have a good day. Bye.